Hi, Essie. I hope you like this week's Bison broadcast. The moment of silence. Now it's time for the pledge. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for all. Sure. Hey, Bison. Today's April 9th, 2021. The high today is 78 degrees with a low of 56 degrees, so it's going to be warm. We don't have any birthdays today, but over the weekend we have Easton, Anthony, Steph, Matilda, Louise, Havel, Chloe, Nicole, Surratt, and Yua Yamauchi. Happy birthday, and make sure, even if we forgot your name, make sure you still get your birthday pencil. Today's lunch, we have pepperoni stuffed crust pizza, cheese stuffed crust pizza, popcorn shrimp, sidekick slush, fresh fruit cup, fresh salad, and sweet potato fries. Enjoy! For breakfast, we're having pancake on a stick, Cheerios, fruit punch, cocoa puffs, and pineapple tidbit. Next week, we have tea cup testing for third, fourth, and fifth grade. And... One month of school left, boys! Yeah! Yeah! Make sure to put your best effort on TCAP testing. Welcome back to announcements. We have TCAP testing for third, fourth, and fifth grade next week. And we only have 32 more days of school left. Woo! Did you know that cotton candy was invented by a dentist named William Morrison? All right, friends, it is time to announce our winners of our Book Madness Tournament. Let's start off looking at our All School Book Madness bracket. Two books were in the finals. We don't need our classmates. And Can I Be Your Dog? And the winner is Can I Be Your Dog? Woo! We got a lot of votes. And then, of course, in our 325 bracket, it was down between Guts, Diary of a Wimpy Kid Deep In. And let me tell you, this was a close one. There was only eight votes that made the difference here. And the winner is Guts. I hope you enjoyed reading all of our books on our brackets this year. And I'll see you later. For this week's book recommendations, I recommend Lifeboat 12 by Susan Hook. It's a great book. Um, it's a chapter book. It's a good size. Um, it's about the Nazis bombing London every night. It's time for 13-year-old Ken to escape. He goes aboard the luxurious ship with great meals, and he meets new friends, and they told him they were out of danger. But they were wrong. That night, an explosion hurls Ken from his bunk. They've been hit. Torpedoed. The Bernie's is sinking fast. I ordered a chicken and an egg off Amazon. We'll tell you which came first. <laughs> That's all for this week, Bison. Make sure you be ready, respectful, and responsible.